A ribbon skirt is a traditional skirt worn by Native Americans all across the country. Often made of a cotton fabric with layers of colorful ribbon sewn onto it, the ribbon skirt is worn to many events, including ceremonies, powwows, and round dances. As a Grand Ronde tribal member, I have been wanting to learn how to make a ribbon skirt for a long time. Luckily, tribal members Joanna Brisbow and her daughter Mabel Brisbow taught a ribbon skirt class on Saturday, May 20th in the tribe's Portland office, and I was able to join. Here's what I learned in the ribbon skirt workshop. You begin by picking out which fabric you're going to use as your main skirt portion. You then iron it so it's wrinkle-free and ready to cut. Measure your leg length, hip, and waist measurements. Use those measurements to cut the appropriate amount of fabric to form a skirt shape. Joanna showed us a trick of folding it to make the cut symmetrical. We then pick out the three ribbon colors we liked. You can have more ribbons, but because this is a beginner class, we chose to start with three. The ribbons are cut the width of the skirt and glued into place using Elmer's glue sticks. The glue will eventually wash away. Going on, you align the two pieces of the skirt and sew them together. You sew the skirt inside out so the stitch is hidden within. Once the skirt is looking more like a skirt, you can hem it and sew a pocket along the waist where an elastic will go. This is what my skirt ended up looking like. I am so appreciative of Joanna and Mabel for teaching us how to make ribbon skirts. After the class, I called up Cultural Resources Department Manager David Harrelson and asked him about ribbon skirts. He clarified for me that our ancestors actually wore cedar bark or maple bark skirts. This doesn't mean that ribbon skirts are less traditional though. Although ribbon skirts may not have originated from the regional tribes of this area, they have become a shared cultural tradition worn by tribal people all across the country today.